Good morning. I wanted to go over with you a little bit about how clean the harp stays with a kettle well frictionless mouthpiece slider. I invented this and I actually designed and manufactured this one too. I call it cool ice because it looks like an ice cube to me. I knew that it would provide friction-free movement to new note hole positions and our relaxed embouchure. You don't have to do that anymore. But one of the things I found was that because it's played not with wet lips or lubricating with saliva, of course it, it affects the ability to go from note hole to note hole position without the use of saliva as a lubricant because your lips do not slide on the mouthpiece the bottom side of the slider does. Well, one of the things that I didn't see coming with this, because I knew it would be friction free and I knew it would change embouchure, was the fact that the lips are played dry against the slider means that the harp stays totally clean. And when I say totally clean, I mean totally clean. And I want to show you now what my instrument looks like after 100 hours of play. Let's take a look first at the calm of this Seidel Symphony Grand Chromatic. It is in like new condition with no corrosion anywhere. Even more intriguing, let's look at the reed plate. Brand new condition, absolutely perfect condition, no signs of any corrosion, no problems with breath savers over 100 hours, absolutely and perfect brand new condition. I'm amazed. I'm astounded. I didn't expect it to look this good. I just took it apart this morning to show you. But what we need to find is a manufacturer who's willing to take this idea and make it available to you at a reasonable cost. The time it takes me to hand craft them and hack them and shape them out of a chunk of plastic is too much. But it can be manufactured rather easily with injection equipment. So anyway, again, my message is that the Kennewell frictionless mouthpiece results in an instrument which stays in like new condition, whether we're talking about the comb or the reed plate. Isn't that beautiful? Again, just astounding. None of the gunky corrosion you normally see. Now, I, ha I do take apart the mouthpiece every once in a while to lubricate it with Hetman's, and I will also, you know, uh, maybe once every two months or three months, um, clean it just because I like it absolutely perfect but there's no corrosion in on it either I just you know there get you get a little bit of, of build up I suppose over time of airborne mucus and stuff but I didn't see anything because I'm again I'm playing with a that instrument with a kettlewell frictionless mouthpiece uh, slider which plays dry the lips are dry so anyhow, that's kind of a fun one.